Hi, this is Jenny with Simply Beautiful Crafts on behalf of Expert Village, and today we're going to make a simple, sweet summer candle ring. You want to start out with a pretzel wreath that you know is going to fit your candle. You either made it big enough to begin with, or you used your candle when you first made it. You want to have a little bit of space beyond the candle so that as your ornaments spill over, there's still room for your candle. This one was a lot of fun to do, and unlike most of my wreaths, I kind of placed things and then glued as I went. I used a combination of silk flowers and paper flowers. You can also use real things like baby's breath. What I did was just to cut off the buds of the flowers and place them around on the wreath where I thought I would like them, and I started with just my sunflowers. And I put a sunflower in the same corner of each one of the pretzels. That way, I had a, I had a rhythm and I had symmetry, and yet you might not want it to be exactly symmetrical. This would be one that I would do perhaps with roses and maybe daisies. So you put your first flowers in in exactly the spot that you want. When you have it the way you will like it, take your glue gun. I went around this part of the flower like this so that it would stick inside the pretzel. And these, are, these stems are a little bit too long. You'd want to cut them shorter and put them in. So I started first with just the sunflowers. After that, I took the little yellow roses. So you would take your second color of flower or your second style of flower and cut it off and then place it. Perhaps this one would go at the bottom of the pretzel all the way around. So you go ahead and put the second one in and then maybe a third and maybe a fourth. You've already planned your colors and your different flowers before you start. But if you start with one flower and then your second flower and then your third flower, it'll be a lot easier to do your ring than if you try to lay them all in and then pick them up and put them, glue them on. That would be much more time consuming and difficult than doing one particular flower at a time. When you're finished, your glue is dry because you're using a hot glue gun, it's dry already. Just slip that over your candle and there you have a sweet summer candle ring. 